eat in or eat out? It's a really good question. Um, I don't know, does anyone on the panel have a sort of I an answer? I got an, I, it's not an answer. I think the question is when you eat in, are you using what's in your fridge? Are you cooking too much? Are you throwing out the waste? Are you dealing with the waste at home with your, um, with your little composting system? Uh, have you a solution for that? And if you're eating out, are you ordering too much? Are you wasting it? Are you leaving it on your plate? Do you like it? Have you thought about where you're going? You know, yeah. I, I think I don't, you know. There's I, things I, you can do in both scenarios. Yeah, there's Natalie. so many. Don't eat out if it's compromising eating in. Oh, does that make sense? Don't eat, don't eat out if it's, if it's going to create, if you have food in your fridge that you can eat in. That's a very good point, because yeah. I think one of the biggest causes of food waste at home is that people decide to get takeaway or eat, or out, eat out, even though they've got food at home, just because they're a bit tired and they haven't planned. Yeah, that's yeah, right. That's so a good point. So, yeah, that's, that's my advice. I think more philosophically, eat in or eat out. You know, maybe when you're eating out and you know you're not starving, can you share a meal? Can you just get an entree? So it's more a philosophical yeah. approach to what can I do to just manage my consumption so there isn't something left at the end. So there isn't um, half a loaf of bread left on the table when we leave the restaurant and there's a whole thing of vegetables left there. So respecting the food and thinking about, from my perspective as a farmer, thinking about the years that have gone into making that and then making a decision about how much you eat or how much you order if you're eating mm. out and how much, you, how much you buy and have on hand when you're eating in.